Hey guys, another challenge assessment from Copperpite gas yes, station. So this time around is difficulty hard. Uh, again, more points if you're into this. So description uh, for this one, for this challenge we will be determining whether a car can get around a route with limited amount of gas. Interesting. So okay. So it's implementation perspective. Uh, we have a function is usually empty, so and more details there. So yeah, let's read it through. Guest station. We have function guest station. Take string array, which will be array cons uh, consisting of the following elements n, which will be the numbers of guest station in uh, circular route, uh, and each uh, subsequent element will be string g semicolon c well g is the amount of gas in gallons okay uh, at the gas station and c will be amount of gallon of gas needed to get to the following gas station for example maybe four after that we have three one two two and such your goal is return the index of starting gas stations that will allow you to travel around the whole route uh, once. Uh, uh, otherwise, return the string impossible. Uh, uh, so yeah, impossible string, again, just jumping into solutioning. Uh, this is kind of specific case. It's not true, it's not indefinite, whatever. So it should be specific case that you need to handle and return this kind of custom string. For example, above there is four gas station and your program should return string one. Uh, uh, because starting at station uh, one, you receive three gallon uh, of gas sp uh, uh, and spend one getting to the next station. Then you have to, uh, right, so we got three gallon and we got one gallon to the next. After that we receive it two and to, to next we will spend the same. After that we will receive just one, but for next we will need two. Uh, yes, that makes sense. Then you have two gallons as, uh, and you get third. Uh, uh, you then have three, but you spend a two getting to the final station. At the final station you will receive zero gallons. Uh, and you spend your final gallon getting to your uh, starting point. Uh, start, uh, starting in the, any uh, other gas station uh, would make getting around uh, route impossible. So the answer is one. So, uh, so there is a multiply gas station that are possible to start uh, uh, at returning smallest index of gas station and will be uh, more and equal to. So again, we're dealing at least with two station and such. So are we saying, uh, are we saying that we will have four impossible and we will say, hey, four. We, we need to spend, we got zero, we got one and we'll go through the motion. Okay. So let's see, yeah, with implementation video again, doing JavaScript here. Yeah, let me know if you would like to see other implementations. So um, here is one of version of implementation. So again, we will introduce uh, stations. So we'll get as a first, uh, we'll parse it through the first uh, station out there. Uh, for initiation, after that, we will start our main loop. Uh, uh, so again, just we'll dive in into the logic, so it will return the index, or again, if that will loop, kind of, uh, will be exited without kind of breaking on the return, we will uh, submit uh, impossible. So we handle that case, so let's dive in, we'll loop uh, through each guest station uh, to check if it's possible to travel around the whole route. So, so, uh, so again, as we uh, saw this one, so it wouldn't be like single line, so it basically will be the whole circle uh, out there. So uh, we will uh, we start our loop here, so we'll after that loop uh, each gestation from K 
current starting starting point so gas station we start at zero here but after that we will uh, see if other station will deliver to us so calculate index of current gas station so we'll go uh, with calculation here after that we sp uh, split gas station distance and value so again we will use split remember that we have this kind of uh, uh, a specific format that we need specifically to parse it through uh, it's not like well structured uh, data that we need additional logic here also add uh, uh, guess at the current station and subtract distance to the next station so again we parse it through so and again from string we go to integer uh, and again, assumption that it's kind of format is okay by default every time. Uh, if there is enough uh, guess to travel to the next station, break out of the loop. So uh, again, if something will break out and will or jump into the impossible. Uh, here, again, if there is enough guess to travel around the whole route, return starting index. So again, if guess we good, more than zero, so we'll return as a particular index uh, of the loop and uh, we will uh, be good and plus one just yeah correct uh, then write indexing there so cool so let's run the code so let's say impossible let's run the cases impossible correct and we got four correct I guess from this perspective, I guess we should be good. So let, let's go with submission. Again, our usual stuff, uh, running test cases. We'll accelerate this. Okay, completion of all tests. Submitting. And we knock it out. Uh, so, uh, so we have all corrected. Uh, uh, so we uh, so all test cases are correct so we good so again timing in my case please do ignore so from this perspective you can still see how other people are doing uh, as usual uh, source code with comments will be again in description below uh, for gas station uh, challenge uh, assessment so let me know if you would like to see any other versions or any other challenges of that please like subscribe comment see you guys in the next one bye bye